Okay, welcome. Good to see you. Just want to show you very quickly how I deal with this problematic window here. Um, I'm just cleaning the windows on this property and it's always just this one window that gets really greasy and grimy. The reason is there's a barbecue. I'm pretty sure it's the greasy, fatty smoke that gets up on the window. If they use the barbecue here on the patio, um, it's quite can be quite a common problem in the summer where people use their barbecues and the greasy, grimy, fatty smoke gets on the glass. Really difficult to clean off. I don't know if you can see on the window there. If I show you up close, maybe the windowsill, you can see it's quite dirty and grimy. Um, but hopefully you can see the difference. Just the brush and the pure water on its own doesn't clean it off. So I'll show you how I deal with it. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wet up the window first with the pure water and the brush, as usual, let it all soak. And then I'm gonna apply a TFR to the brush. I've got a number of these squirty bottles in the van. This one's got the TFR in it. I know that because I've written on TFR on the side of the bottle. I oh, know, that's clever, isn't it? I mean, my mother always told me I wasn't just a pretty face. <laughs> so there we go. Whatever TFR you use, this is a caustic TFR. It's quite strong. Um, whatever product you use, just check the label, check the dilution rates. Um, but what I'm gonna do, once I've wet up the window with the pure water, I'm just gonna apply a generous amount of this directly to the brush. I'm doing it this way so that I don't have to get out a whole set of spray equipment. I don't have to bring out the backpack. I literally just can grab this spray bottle, spray a generous amount directly on the brush. Then I'm going to apply it to the window. I'll keep the water flow off for now. I've already wet up the window. So then I'm just going to apply the cleaning solution that's on the brush across the window. Give that a, a scrub across the window and then let that sit. I'll go and do a different window let it sit there for just a few minutes don't let it dry out because it's strong stuff you don't want to leave it on there too long so i'm going to do another window come back to it give it a good scrub with the pure water this time give it a good wash as normal with the pure water rinse it all away and it should come up a treat Make sure you give it a good scrub. Make sure you give it a really good rinse. You want to make sure you rinse away all that soapy water. You can repeat that process if necessary. Sometimes I might do it a couple of times if the window's really dirty. And that's how I do it. So I hope you find that useful. I hope that helps. Um, it's a nice quick little way of dealing with just if you know on a job you've just got one or two in particular windows that are especially dirty it's a really quick and easy way to deal with just those odd dirty windows like that without having to mess about and get out a lot of other equipment spray equipment backpacks anything like that so that's a really nice easy way of dealing with it and look at that look how clean we've got that window now So I hope that helps, hope you find that useful. Don't forget to check out my channel, loads more in the playlists. Don't forget to subscribe, like the video, and uh, I look forward to catching up with you guys again very soon. Take care.